get to. <laughs> Hey guys and welcome to this weekly vlog so we're back to regular scheduled programming regular vlogs um but i'm gonna try make it a little bit different to my normal vlogs like it's still gonna be montage it's still gonna be aesthetic i don't know still gonna be long maybe not who knows last week's vlog was only 10 minutes um so let me know if you liked that shorter vlog but yes today i just woke up and made pancakes and they were really good but i'm really full like so full then i as you saw i folded all our washing from my gist and because there was there was barely any sun yesterday so yes um yeah i have a few more things that i want to film what's on my to-do list let me show you also don't forget to subscribe give this video a thumbs up if you do enjoy it and yeah so my to-do list today, I had to make pancakes and I did that and I folded the laundry and I want to watch more Grey's Anatomy and watch some YouTube, but I also want to do my Grey's Anatomy journal spread in my journal. I also want to wash my hair because I did this when I was filming a video for Wednesday and I really need to wash my hair. It's 2.30 now and I just spent the past four hours editing Wednesday's video. It took me so long. There was a lot of chops and changes. And yeah, it was a really good video to edit. I haven't had to high quality, like full on edit a video like that. But now I'm going to go make some lunch and then go make another coffee because I'm dead. Um, and then empty the dishwasher and do the dishes from this morning. This is just a look at my bullet journal for today, for, for the week. But essentially, I write my weekly agenda down here. So like when I just, my workouts, when I do yoga, and my filming schedule, when videos go live, when I have to film and edit. But today I have to film this vlog, finalize my video for tomorrow, watch Grey's Anatomy because I'm obsessed, empty the dishwasher, clean up downstairs, do a core workout and read my book. <laughs> Thank you. 
back from a walk i just listened to the coffee talk podcast by kayla nicholson i highly recommend going on a walk i don't do it as much as often as i should but i went on a 20 minute walk which was so nice reset routine my daily reset routine um and i'm just about to now continue my night routine and jump in the shower not a vlog it's not a grace Charles vlog if ella's not in it right yeah i always have to be in the vlogs i'm an important asset to this <laughs> channel because i just am she just can't do it by herself i really wanted an outfit that would keep me warm but i can't really find anything and i'm like I don't really just want to wear a hoodie because I feel like I always just wear a hoodie. So I like tried this on. I feel like it is cute, but it also looks really weird. So not 100% sure. We'll probably change before I go out. But currently, this is what I'm wearing. Just solely just into the t-shirt. I don't know. I kind of vibed. I tried on a couple of different things and just decided on this. I feel like if I had a white long sleeve that didn't have a high neck, would kind of look better it is wednesday now so i'm just out with my mum. we're gonna run to beyond to get a plant to ikea to kmart just do a few errands perth is lifting their restrictions slowly um in like phases so i feel like it's okay to vlog in public and i thought i'd update you guys first run to Kmart we have to go a second time because we couldn't print our photos that we wanted and I'm probably going to get my mirror I'm going to insert a photo here and what I want to do for my room but I'm just going to do a little haul I got these scrunchies because is it a Kmart run if you don't get unnecessary things no I just I needed like new scrunchies I've been wearing them a lot and then I got these pens these are just retractable silicon gel pens they're kind of a knockoff of what Kristen made Kristen Johns was talking about and I just think they're really cute and then I got these highlighters which are brush highlighters and I'm really hoping they're gonna like work for my bullet journal but that is all the unnecessary things I got it was only ten dollars so yeah so clearly we are home I ended up going back into the store to try on jeans but it, they didn't fit so that's fine we ended and then we got lunch we just got chinese they had like five dollar takeaway chinese containers that had like a combination of stuff so i had sweet and sour pork and salad and satay chicken in mine which is literally like my favorite food ever and literally the way to my heart um but yes then we ended up going to another kmart to get our photos printed and so i got my photos and i'm so excited i'm kind of scared because i've had this wall for two years now and I have to dismantle it and then put another a new one up. But something else I got. I also got these new black slippers with little compounds on them. But other than that, nothing else to update you guys on. I didn't film in the store because again, chaotic. Oh, and we didn't end up going, we didn't end up going to IKEA, which is where I was planning on filming, because we got there and the line was like a 45 minute wait, we presumed from how long it was. So yes, we didn't go, but we're home now and I'm going to dismantle my wall and I'm kind of scared. <laughs>
do list today we have film vlog wake up for sunrise which i did and then kind of fell back asleep plan my day which i did in my bullet journal have breakfast which i'm about to go do edit this vlog it's gonna be a long one work on my photo wall because obviously i got photos yesterday and i want to take like my goals down and my clock doesn't even work and then i normally have a hit on thursdays I normally do a hit session on thursdays but yesterday me and my sister bought Oh, so my sister and I bought um, Sarah's Day both her ebook because she did a 50% off sale for both of them. So you might as well just get both. And I'm going to do the week one um, sweaty shredder from that. And then I also want to kind of read and read a big chunk of my book because I'm nearly finished. you would have just seen I just dismantled my photo wall of two years so I hope you can see me and I hope I'm in focus um, mind my hair but don't mind my hair is what I meant I just separated the photos I printed out yesterday into two separate file piles so the photos I want on the bottom half of my wall and the photos I want on top half of my wall if you're making a photo wall I recommend like picking out your favorite ones because you want them you want to showcase them and you want them to be like, you want to be able to see them every day. So I've separated them, so is dad. I really like this photo, but I'm going up the top. But I've just sorted, and this is the array of them. But yes, I'm going to get the blue tack and get started on sticking. Continue, I'm still listening to Thick and Thin. I've just like, I've got like five episodes I need to catch up on, so I'm just gonna listen to them. Probably listen to all of them whilst I do this because this is a very long task. Inside of us, that means we need to identify what part of us we need to either work on or just work on understanding. Really, it's. I haven't really updated you guys since starting this project but essentially as you can see it is coming along very nicely i'm on like my fourth episode of thick and thin i'm still got a long way to go on this side of the wall but this side is complete i'm obsessed with it i can't wait tonight to like light a candle and stuff but i think it's really good and i'm in love I have officially, don't mind the camera in the background, I have officially finished my photo wall. It has taken me three hours. I started at like 11 um, once I finished editing the vlog, like so far. And then I started on this and I'm so happy I did it on like both sides. I'll show you what I mean. I'm so happy I did it here as here and here. So it kind of like cohesively ties it both together. I'm just obsessed with the new wall. 
I should have. Ah, I didn't take a before. I should have taken a before video. I'm sure in my archives I have a video of it. But yeah, I'm so happy and I'm extremely happy. I did both sides and I'm like obsessed. That now when you see my content, you'll see like both walls. And but yeah, I'm now gonna go make lunch, which is gonna be like soup and grilled cheese. I got my lunch. I just got sweet potato soup that my mum made yesterday, uh, grilled cheese, and then a lemonade. I still have to finish my chai, but I'll finish that later on today, once I've finished all this. So I have just finished that, and I just finished eating lunch. It was really tasty, and I'm about to start I'm Sarah's ebook. I'm like been waiting to buy these forever, but I'm gonna do the week one sweaty shredder. This one here on the Monday. You know those fresh shower feels? That's what I'm having right now. Um, before my shower, I did the first, if you know Sarah Day's ebook, I did her first ebook, Sweat It to Shred It week one sweaty shredder which is 30 minutes but yeah and i just had a shower it was that hair day and i was so happy i did the workout because then i could wash my hair well i have a better reason to wash my hair and i just changed and i need to type up a little brief recommendation sheet for a friend or for a friend who is in year 12 for this year and doing the yearbook um, for those of you who went to school with me or know me personally would know that I did the year 12 I worked on with a team for the year 12 yearbook and this girl contact, contacted me yesterday just asking for recommendations and I have a lot of recommendations because I put a lot of time and effort into that yearbook so yes that is what I'm going to be doing for the next however long it is three o'clock so my sister should be home actually very shortly and then I'm gonna go on a walk with my friend, Ashley, at sunset. situation such a vibe mm. how cute we are i just think this is such a vibe vibing see you bye thanks see for your bye what and go on a walk with ashley for a sunset i've got all my essentials hand sanitizer that's an essential right now hey guys it's a lot later now um i went on a walk with ashley had dinner watched master chef with mum which is always a fun time um and i'm about to ring nathan and just chat with him and yeah so i just thought i'd end today's portion of the vlog tomorrow and i will see you guys tomorrow if i don't continue the vlog tomorrow don't forget to subscribe give this video a thumbs up and yeah peace out got this previously but clearly using one of the snapchat filters right now i'm just waiting for nathan to join and yeah nope you're still here Hi guys i hope you guys enjoyed today's or well, this week's vlog a bit different because i showed you putting together a photo wall which i'm gonna try and incorporate like a little focus well not a focus but like um me doing something in the vlogs so this was my week's project 
I'm obsessed, I'm in love. If you haven't seen, I'm sorry I bombarded you with videos of it, but obviously it was fresh and brand new and I did that with my laptop case and I'm severely sorry, but don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you guys enjoyed it. Go check out my Instagram, it's just at race jars with an extra s at the end spotify everything everything mentioned will be linked down below with that being said i will see you guys next week with another video or vlog